Hey there, space enthusiasts! Today, we're diving into some fascinating space weather news. A massive coronal hole is now directly facing Earth, and trust me, it's a big deal. This coronal hole stretches across the Sun's southern hemisphere and is releasing a stream of high-speed solar wind. What does this mean for us? Well, NOAA has issued a G1 geomagnetic storm watch for later this weekend. While G1 storms are considered minor, they can still enhance auroras in high-latitude regions. So, if you're up north, keep your eyes peeled for some amazing sky shows. But what exactly is a coronal hole? Coronal holes are regions in the sun's outer atmosphere known as the corona, where the magnetic field opens outward into space. Unlike the loops we usually see, these fields don't return to the solar surface, allowing plasma to escape more efficiently. This forms those high-speed solar wind streams we're talking about. When you look at ultraviolet images from spacecraft like NASA's Solar Dynamics Observatory, you'll see these coronal holes as dark patches. They appear this way due to lower density and temperature in those regions. Now you might be wondering, are these common? Well, coronal holes are more frequent and often larger during the solar maximum, which is the peak of the sun's 11-year activity cycle. Unlike explosive solar flares or coronal mass ejections, coronal holes are a steady source of space weather variability. Want to see today's sun in different wavelengths? It's pretty cool stuff. So, there you have it. Keep an eye on the skies, and stay tuned for more cosmic updates.